Question number 8. Part A asks us to provide the number in the box such that the product of 2 over 3 and the number comes as 10 over 30. So we'll take the fraction which is given to us which is 2 over 3. Now to get the numerator as 10 we must multiply 5 to 2 and to get the denominator as 30 we must multiply 3 with 10. So the fraction that we get is 5 over 10 and that is the number that comes in the box. Now the second bit of part A says that the simplest form of the number obtained is. So the simplest form means that the numerator and denominator should not have any other common factor apart from 1. So we'll take the fraction obtained which is 5 over 10 and we'll try to get rid of all the common factors. So we know that 5 1s are 5 and 5 2s are 10. So the simplest form of the number obtained will be 1 over 2. Coming to the part B of question number 8. In first bit they ask us to provide the number in the box such that the product of 3 over 5 and the number in the box is 24 over 75. So we'll write the given fraction. Now to get the numerator as 24 we must multiply 8 to 3 and in denominator to get 75 we must multiply 5 with 15. So the number in the box is 8 over 15. The second bit says find the simplest form of the number obtained. As we can see that in 8 over 15 there is no other common factor apart from 1. It means that it is already in the simplest form. So the answer for the second bit of part B will be 8 over 15 itself. And this is how we solve this problem. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.